Hello, welcome to Levant TV headlines. CN Deputy Foreign and Expatriates Minister Dr. Faisal Makdad stressed the government's commitment to its obligations under the Convention on the Disengagement of Forces of 1974. U.S. Secretary of State John Kerry landed in Baghdad on Monday to press Prime Minister Nouri al-Maliki to form a more inclusive government. Israeli army detained 37 Palestinians overnight in search for missing teenagers that went missing recently. An Egyptian court has sentenced three Al Jazeera journalists to seven years each in prison. US Secretary John Kerry said Washington is not responsible for either the crisis in Libya or violence in Iraq. A South Korean soldier who killed five of his comrades and injured seven others has been captured after an unsuccessful suicide attempt. In what seems like a planned explosion, the railroad tracks in Ukraine's Donetsk region have been blown up as a freight train belonging to Russian railways was passing by. 14 freight cars were derailed. Supporting the renewable energy is growing worldwide and at the beginning of 2014 almost a tenfold increase since 2005. France's biggest bank, BNP Paribas, has agreed an 8 to 9 billion settlement with U.S. prosecutors, the fine against, could, uh, against the bank could be a record for this type of violation. And to read more, please visit our website, levant.tv. That was it for today. Thanks for watching and bye for now.